Immigration reform fears as President Donald Trump works to carry out his campaign promise of a border wall. Some here in Maryland are worried about how they will be impacted. WJZ is live. George Solis hears from families now living with uncertainty over what comes next. George? Good evening, Denise. As the president begins delivering on a signature campaign promise dealing with immigration reform, concerns are growing tonight that the impacts could be devastating for many, including the children of undocumented immigrants. President Donald Trump signed an executive order to start building the wall along the Mexican border. The Secretary of Homeland Security, working with myself and my staff, will begin immediate construction of a border wall. A promise Mr. Trump campaigned on heavily in his run for office. A nation without borders is not a nation. Beginning today, the United States of America gets back control of its borders. The White House is also focusing on immigration. The president took executive action restricting immigration from countries that harbor terrorists, and he wants undocumented immigrants already in America deported. Within the immigrant community, emotions are running high. Many living in fear of a future where now, more than ever, there's so much unknown, especially for children of undocumented immigrants. How are you perceiving everything? It's kind of hard. Because they're like, I don't know if I'm going to, you know, see them again if, like, I come back from school. And then I have a little sister, and I don't know what's going to happen with her. Wednesday, groups like Casa de Maryland holding an emergency meeting in Baltimore and a rally in D.C. to try and work through some of these fears. I feel like me as a youth, I should be focusing on school and stuff like that, not about losing my friends and losing family members that I really love. They say all they can do is wait and see how it will all play out. It's just really tense because you don't know what's going to happen. Now, the president is also trying to strip federal funding from so-called sanctuary cities that shield undocumented immigrants. Our live tonight, George Solis, WJZ Eyewitness News. All right, thank you, George. Now, tonight, Mexico's president rejected the U.S. decision to build a border wall and vowed that his country will not pay for it. He says he may cancel his planned visit to Washington next week.